Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So this channel, Everyday Data Science, is all about trying to learn various concepts involved in data science by practicing a lot of questions. Okay, in this video, I am going to solve this question on lead code, which is called Triangle Judgment, and try to walk you through how we can develop queries in such problems. Okay, so let's jump right in. We are given a table called Triangle with three different columns, X, Y, and Z where x, y, and z are the length of the sides of the triangle. And the combination of x, y, and z is the primary key column for this table. Each row of this table contains the length of the three line segments. Now, we are asked to write a SQL query to report for every three line segments whether they can form a triangle. The order of the result does not matter. Okay, so let's go ahead and see and go through this example so this is the example that is being given so the values of x y and z or basically the three line segments that is making a triangle is given and we need to determine whether it is possible to make a triangle with these given values or not so to solve this question the first thing that we need to know is on what condition the given three values will make a triangle so a triangle is only possible if the summation of two sides is always greater than the third side so basically what it means is that summation of x and y should be greater than z summation of y and z should be greater than x and summation of x and z should be greater than y let's see if this is the case here so if you add x plus y in this case so this is going to be 28 which is less than 30 so if any of the summations is less than the third side then the triangle is not possible but if you uh, take this case so 10 plus 20 30 is greater than 15 20 plus 15 that is 35 is greater than 10 and 10 plus 15 is 25 which is greater than 20 so in this case the triangle is possible uh, this question has been asked in Facebook twice in last one year. Okay, so let's go ahead and develop this query. Okay, so from this table called triangle, what do we need to do? So the output should also have all these three columns. So the first thing is we need to return every column. And how do we return every column? We select star. Then there is another, the fourth column that is called triangle where we are going to suggest whether the triangle is possible or not. So comma. Now in this case, what do we need to do? We need to use case when then clause. Okay. So case when and the condition that needs to be satisfied to be a triangle when three different line segments are given is x plus y greater than z and y plus z greater than x and x plus z x plus z greater than y so when all these conditions are satisfied then you return yes if any one if any one of the following does not satisfy so else you return no because in those cases triangle won't be possible and then since you need to alias it as triangle so you end the case statement and then alias it as triangle Okay, so let's go ahead and run this and see what happens. Okay, so this is accepted and our output is same as expected output. Let's submit this and see if it passes all the test cases or not. So yes, this, this is accepted and passes all the test cases. So yeah, this is how we solve this question. And what we learn from this is that there are some questions that can be asked in some interviews where you would need to have some prior knowledge. So in this question, if you didn't know 
what are what is the condition that we look for if three line segments are given and to see whether a triangle can be made from those three line segments or not is basically this the summation of two sides should always be greater than the third side and this should be for all the three cases so yeah let me know if you guys found it useful and i will see you guys in the next video